Hello friends, welcome back to the farm. You know what these are? This is a type of plant, flower, called Anthurium. They were really hard, they have a hard flower. Almost seems like a leaf, but it is not. It is a flower. Yesterday, I got to, I went to someone's place to pick up plants from Craigslist. And it turns out they have a whole Anthurium forest and they are uh, a vendor basically of this kind of flower. I ended up helping them pick a bunch of these from, uh, from their forest for an upcoming order they have to fill. And the person gave me a whole bunch of these cuttings as a thank you. And these are all discards, believe it or not. Some of these are bigger than my, like look at the size of my hand compared to some of these. Look at this beauty. Many different colors. I love these white ones. Red and white. These gigantic heart-shaped ones. So beautiful. I just wanted to share with you and show you all the different varieties that we have. This one's a real heart. This one has two flowers. Do you see this? Yeah, it looks like, see this one is damaged right here. That's one of the reasons why it would be a reject. It's so beautiful. Let me show you the rest of these because they're all special and amazing. This one's really big. That one's about the size of my head. I love these dark red ones. You can't regrow them from cuttings. I'll show you though how they grow. Some of your red heart. There's some little ones. This one's cool. It has a, a two color stalk thing in the middle there. And she told me this variety that is in white and also in red and a few other colors. These are called tulip variety. You can compare because the leaf looks more like a tulip as opposed to like this one, which looks more like a heart. Or this one, which is also a heart. I love these. I can't even pick which one is my favorite each time I go to look. They're all so beautiful. I love this one with the speckles. She said this is called a, a splash type pattern, if you ever see it in the store. There's two more. I just have these in water. Look at these beauties. And the stems are huge too. Look at this. This is maybe, this is easily a two foot tall stem. And these weren't even the super tall ones. I think the tallest one she harvested was maybe four feet. It was almost, it almost came up to her, to her neck. I could show you the ones, so we only had a couple from a neighbor and they're teenies by comparison. Now that I know they're the tulip variety, the neighbor gave them to us. They do great. They're in this shady area. I just set them and covered them a little bit with leaf litter. They don't even get direct rain and they're happy. So let me show you what it looks like. So she gave me a couple of the full plants too. So here's one. This is a pink tulip variety. It's so pretty. I don't even know if the camera is capturing it properly, but... So pretty. This is what their leaves look like. And then the base is... It's basically like an air plant, right? Like it's in a pot, but it doesn't really need to be. And this whole area is like the root base and it puts out more roots from there. And they kind of just grow on top of each other and you can separate them out 
similar to an orchid if you've ever done that. So here are a couple that she just pulled out of the out and gave to me. So these don't have the flowers on them. Here is the base. This looks, it's like this is the, the base part and then it's like stalks coming up from here. Now she said this, which is maybe like six inches. She said I can take this and cut it about in half and this side will grow new shoots as well. So that's good to know. Here's another one she gave me. This one already, it's gonna have a flower soon. And you can see the same thing here. It's got this long base with roots coming off of it. This is all kind of like its root base kind of. Then she said this I can cut in half as well and have new plants coming up from that. Do you have any anthurium? Do you like anthurium? I got, I've gotten really into them. I got, I have anthurium envy since living here because people here have such beautiful anthuriums and it's like, no party is complete without anthuriums. I'll do one more showing for you of all the beautiful ones that we've got. And that'll be the end of this video. If you have any questions, let me know. I hope you enjoy all this lusciousness. So many colors, shapes, and sizes. Just amazing. <laughs>